Let's read the passage. Archaeologists have been debating the origin of a rare form of lead found in Shang Dynasty bronze artifacts since its presence was discovered in China in the 1990s. Different researchers have proposed proposed theories on which regions of the world uh, would have had the raw materials uh, containing the specific lead in these artifacts. That's a weird sentence. But no conclusive evidence has been presented. Hmm, no conclusive evidence. What is intriguing is that bronze artifacts from China dated after the Shang Dynasty do not contain this form of lead, suggesting that... Okay, I don't know. The something like the they stopped using it? I don't know, something like that. Stopped using it. Maybe that or something about like they only used it they, they you know, this other part of the world stopped mining it or whatever. I don't know, something changed. Right? How about that? Something changed. Very dumb. Very dumb summary. Okay, let's look at the choices. Uh, the Shang Dynasty bronze pieces are rare and therefore more valuable than those from other time periods. I don't care about the value, right? So this is a, a comparison. Uh, other time periods, it, it's not, I don't care what they're worth. So get rid of it. B, the source of some of the raw materials used to make bronze was exploited only until the end of the Shang t- Dynasty. Then something changed. They stopped getting it, right? That's kind of what I said. So it's, it, that seems to match what I expected. That's a good sign. Let's look at C. Uh, bronze was used for a short time during the Shang Dynasty before different metals were used to make artifacts. Different metals? No, it's about the lead. Maybe they kept using lead. Maybe they didn't. I mean, um, it does say what is intriguing is bronze artifacts from China dated after do not contain this form of lead. It does not say it does not contain lead. In fact, I think bronze needs to. So uh, it doesn't work. It's it's one of those things that they're, they're definitely going too far. They're close and it kind of sounds like what they're saying but they are saying, they're making an assumption. They are going further than the passage does. We're not allowed, not allowed to do that. So we're not talking about different metals. D, methods used to analyze bronze artifacts are not useful on pieces that are dated after the Shang Dynasty. No, it's not about the methods. Not useful. Just think of it. Like, this is a very negative choice, right? It's saying the science was bad. Is this a negative passage? Are they saying that there's some bad science, some bad experiment, some bad method that they used? No, it's basically just a description of this this lead and and the facts about it, right? It doesn't seem positive to me, but it doesn't seem negative either. It's a very neutral passage. So why are we going to have a negative answer choice summarizing a very neutral passage? So yeah, it's B. That's what I expected it to be based on kind of my, my prediction. But even if you didn't make that prediction, I think you can get to B by eliminating the other choices pretty confidently. They have nothing to do with what we're talking about, whereas B is is sticking to... The, the, the lead. Now, notice what they did. Some of the raw materials used to make bronze. That is a very complicated way of saying this particular type of lead. This is why you can't really focus on the nouns in the passage. When you go and look for things in the choices, they very often rename things. They, they, they call them by different sets of words so that the answer choice isn't obvious. So, you know, if you get too locked into, oh, it's got to talk about lead, you're going to get rid of choice B when it is talking about lead. It's just using the other words besides the word lead. That's a very common thing that they do. Uh, if that really bothers you, then yeah, you're going to get a lot of stuff wrong because that's going to happen pretty much every question. They're going to take some word in the passage and use a synonym or some other phrase to talk about it without talking about it. That's why you focus on verbs. That's why you focus on uh, descriptive words, adjectives, because what they say about the thing is more important than the way they name the thing. So they didn't, I didn't even notice it until I started talking about it. But yeah, B is definitely it.